Hey y'all, it's Caitlin, pronoun she, her, and I got my package from uh, Funko NYCC release, but before that I got some mail from some friends. So first off, this is addressed to Caitlin Ellis IV, and it's from, on the back, she put BK Phipps for the fifth. You, you never know what the hell Christina's gonna write, but it's a llama card, and on the inside, you have been donged. Ha ha ha, Violet. <laughs> so, Christina's mom and her daughter went to Vietnam for about a month. Um, including travel and everything, it was a month. And they brought back some more Vietnamese dongs. So, this is what they call their dollars. They sent one to us a while back. So, that's the first one right there. It's been back there ever since. So, this one's going to join it. So, thank you, Christina. Uh, I can now say I've been donged twice by my best Catholic friend, which very few people can say that. Uh, and this is actually from Dave. Um, Dave mentioned that he was going to be organizing his Pokemon cards. And I said, if there's any in there that are Ninetales that you don't care uh, to get rid of, like I'll buy them off of you. And he said, I'll just send them. I got in my head recently that I want to try to collect every Ninetales card. I have some from like years ago um but i still have a lot <laughs> to go through but he sent me some stickers too so so here's his newest logo you guys haven't seen it this is the hollow version and some more like regular stickers so he's got <laughs> marilyn monroe we got gay shoes a gay bird a <laughs> shark with a unicorn horn <laughs> over a rainbow sand. What? That that one might be my favorite. And this little cute koala <laughs> thing. So all those are going in my sticker book. And I thought he was only sending two. He sent five. <laughs> so we got some regular ones though. Like there's a reverse hollow. I don't know what. That looks like the newer kind of uh, reverse pattern. So this must be one of the Paldea sets. Um, but I don't know off the top of my head which sets are these. I'll have to look them up. But we got one of Lolan Ninetales in the mix. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, I think this is the one from uh, Obsidian Flames. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong. This one I think is from Generations. Because I know I had this card and I got rid of it. But so thank you very much Dave. I'll be putting those in my binder. Again I'm going to try to fully complete that set. But anyway now on to the fun stuff. So I bought four items at the Funko shop or on the Funko shop. One was a pop, the other three, believe it or not, are sodas. Because y'all know I'm not a big soda person, but there were three sodas that I wanted. But first off, we got Big Barda here from Justice League. Yes. Just now ho hoping that they make um, Mr. Miracle to go with her. But Big Barda is a really awesome character. Uh, I've seen her several times. There's, you know, she's in an episode of Justice League the Unlimited. Uh, she's in the Birds of Prey comic book. She's in a uh, Superman Batman Apocalypse movie. Absolutely awesome in that movie. So she's a fairly, you know, well-known character. Um, and I just absolutely love her. There is a scuff mark right on her boob. <laughs> I'm just now noticing but she's got her mega rod with her <laughs> uh there's a scene in uh birds of prey where they're all acting like just immature teenagers and making fun kind of like making fun of her weapons name calling being called the mega rod which is hilarious so absolutely love her uh, and also in Birds of Prey, one of my favorite scenes is like, Barda, you're bleeding. And she's like, oh, yeah, I am. And she's bleeding like everywhere. She just didn't know it. And she's like, can someone hand me like a needle and thread and I'll just do it myself. <laughs> it's hilarious. I love this character very, very much. Again, we just need her husband to go with her. Now let's go into the soda. So I got three of them again. We got Sandy Claws. The Halloween Stitch and finally Lord Zed so I'm gonna open Zed first let's see I'm pretty sure 
metallic glow in the dark and a different mold is how it's their chases are so we're gonna see if we get any the stickers on the can that's good and it does have the 30th logo for power rangers right there next to it i don't open sodas enough to have to have bought in one of those soda openers so you're gonna have to give me a minute there we go i got it all right i'm not gonna look at the pog I might have to though because I don't think when I was looking at the glam shots like I could barely tell although I think I think his rod his Z rod has like flames around it if it's the chase too so we'll see about that if I'm right I just got the chase because <laughs> there's the flames and there's definitely the Z rod yes oh I got two the shit I got two chase box Okay, so if anyone gets the Lord Zed Chase and you don't have the Pog, let me know. I'll send you one. Um, because they're both for the Chase. Yeah, that's... Ah, uh, they make so many mistakes with these still. Um, but this is absolutely... Again, you can't barely tell that this is metallic, but it's because of the flame on the rod that you can tell anything. Lord Zed creeped me out when I was a kid because he doesn't have skin, right? Oh, uh, and his voice was like so menacing, but then he was like funny at times. It was weird. So, absolutely amazing. I'm a huge Power Ranger fan, as many people know. So, one chase down, that's pretty damn good to me. So, I'm going to keep the body bag, throw away the trash bag looking one. Okay, now let's go to Stitch. I'm pretty sure this is a glow in the dark one. I could be totally wrong. I haven't really looked at this one to tell. And this is the only one as of right now on their website that's still available. I would have thought that Stitch would have sold out. That one was easy to open. Alright. I can't tell anything yet. It doesn't feel glow in the dark. So yeah, this is a common. So common stitch. And that's perfectly fine with me. Very, very cute. He's got the little skeleton costume going on and it's like a stitch skeleton too it's not like a regular like people skeleton got his little tail in the back <laughs> very very cute so can't complain with that and now sandy claw <clears throat> this one in the common he's got candy stuck in his beard and the other one he's got his hat and he's wearing his hat and he's carrying his list so it's very easy to tell and looks like i got the common so Hey, I got one chase though. I can't complain. And it's one of the ones that sold out. So again, can't complain. So absolutely cool. This guy's got a huge base on him. Like, damn, that's the size of a soda stand. Like, hang on, I got a soda stand here. One of Ezra's. This thing's bigger <laughs> than Ezra's soda thing. Like it's wider. Here he is with all the Halloween candy stuck in his beard from the rotten trick-or-treaters trying to kidnap him. And it's really freaking cool. I love this guy. So that is awesome. I honestly love each of these sodas. I know I'm not usually the person to say that, but I do. Um, Stitch is going to go right up with the Halloween display. But anyway, let me know what y'all got. Did anyone else get any chase luck? Uh, I'm very happy with my Lord Zed Chase, so cannot complain. So thank you all so much for watching. Remember, like always, it's a community, not a competition, and I'll see y'all later. Bye.